Hi and welcome to lesson 2 of understanding guitar chord progressions with Bollywood songs. Thank you very much for all your feedback and suggestions from my previous lesson. And uh, it's been very encouraging and I hope to continue the series for as long as possible and try to answer as many questions which uh, my viewers have. So for today's lesson we are going to pick another Bollywood song just the way we did last time and then take a look at the melody line and uh, figure out the chords which uh, you need to be playing over there try to understand why those chords are being played uh, try to also understand which other chords you could play and which chords you cannot play and things like that uh, but before we go on to that a quick recap of what are the things you need to know from the previous lesson uh, the first thing is you need to know the key of the song whether the song is in A or in B or in C etc you need to know the scale of the song typically we'll be using the major and the minor scales but as we go forward we'll take a look at other scales as well uh, and the third and the most important thing which you need to know is the notes of the song uh, especially the note at the point in time where you want to play a chord uh, with, with these three pieces of information you can pretty much pick up the chords for any song uh, now for today's lesson the song we are going to pick up uh, is uh, based on a major scale but there is a slight variation from uh, the regular major scale or the diatonic major scale. So the regular major scale uh, you're familiar with uses, uh, so for example if you're playing in G major, we'll stick to the example which we did last time, the notes in the scale are G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp. Uh, in today's lesson we are going to do a slight variation instead of uh, using F sharp we will use F. So what you're doing is you're flattening the seventh note of the scale and if you're familiar with Hindustani classical music uh, you're actually using Komalni instead of Shuddhani. So the notes, uh, if you're playing in G, would be G, A, B, C, T, E, F. And if you're, you, if you're familiar with Hindustani music, uh, the notes are Sa, Re, Ga, Ma, Padha and Komalni. So uh, we're going to take two examples today. Uh, and uh, the difference between those two examples are, in the first example, pretty much the entire song uses Komalni or uses the seventh note uh, the flattened seventh note uh, in the major scale and then we are going to use another example in which the song keeps uh, shifting between Shuddhani and Komalni so it uses if, if it's a G it, it would be shifting from uh, F sharp to F and then back to F sharp and so on so now before we take a look at the song and try to figure out the chords let's just get an understanding of the scale which we are going to use so as you know the regular G major scale has the notes G A B C D sharp G. So for today's example what we're going to do is instead of F sharp we're going to use F. So the notes will be G, A, B, C, D, E, F and G. So now that instead of F sharp you're using the note F. Uh, in the previous lesson we learned three chords which you can play in uh, song based on the G major scale and those were the G major, the C major and the D major chords or the C, G, C and D chords. You cannot play D anymore because the, the D chord or the D major chord contains the notes D, F sharp and A and uh, the scale we are using today does not contain the F sharp note, it contains F. So what we are going to do is uh, we are going to substitute this with a new chord which is the F chord or F major chord which contains the notes F, A and C and these three notes are there in the scale which we are going to use today. So you have G, A, B, C, D, E, F and G and you will be able to play three chords G, C and F. So now if you need to know a little bit more about theory, uh, this scale which we are using which contains the F note uh, in the G major scale, in western music this is also known as the mixolydian mode of the diatonic major scale. Uh, we won't go into the details of that, you can uh, check on the internet and you'll get a lot of uh, information out there. And in Hindustani classical music, if you're familiar with thoughts, uh, this uh, uh, song, the songs which are based on this scale uh, are typically based on uh, the family of uh, scales belonging to the thought called the Khamaj thought, which contains the notes Sare, Gama, Padha, Komalni and then Sa. So now let's try and take a look at a song which is based on this scale. Uh, if you've heard of the song Hum Be Wafa Har Gizna Thay from the film Shalimar, the original song is based uh, on E major scale 
we're going to transpose it to G major just for the sake of uh, keeping this lesson consistent with the previous lesson it'll be easier for you to uh, relate uh, to what I've already explained in fact going forward we'll probably take uh, all songs in the same scale in the same key rather so that it's easy to understand uh, the differences so the song begins with this melody and I'm playing it very slowly So this is the original song uh, and uh, we're going to try and figure out which chords are being played. So we'll be using four chords, we'll break this up into four parts. So the first piece of the song is, so the note is B and you can play G major chord because it contains G, B and D and all of those are there in the scale which is being used for the song. The next line. This note is C, so you can play C major, which contains C, E, and G, and all those notes are there in the scale. So this is the note which we introduced today. Instead of F sharp, you've played F. So at this note, what you could do is you can play the chord F, uh, which contains the notes F, A, and C, which are there in the scale. And the last line is G major again. So with four chords, G, C, F, you are able to play uh, the, the chords in this song. In fact, the entire song just contains these three chords mostly. There are many songs which, is, uh, which use the same uh, pattern and all you have to do is just remember uh, that you need to know the three chords. Uh, the first is the major chord based on the first note of the scale and the major chord based on the fourth note of the scale, in this case it was C, and the major chord uh, based on the seventh note of the scale, which in this case is F. So for example, if you were playing in the scale of uh, C major, the chords would be C, F and B flat because C is the first note of the scale uh, uh, C major. Then the fourth note of that scale is F, so you are playing F major. Uh, the seventh note is B flat instead of B in this case. So you will be playing B, major, B flat major and then back to C. So with this knowledge, you can pretty much play uh, songs which uh, all songs which are based on this uh, particular scale.